Hey, today I'm talking about the new movie Civil War. This was written and directed by Alex Garland, a director I'm a big fan of. I've watched everything that he's directed and have thoroughly enjoyed all of them. This one's pretty interesting. And the basic premise is what if modern day America was in a civil war? Except not exactly because this film tried very hard to stay away from modern politics. But that's not really what it's about. It's much more about like the horror of war. It follows a group of war journalists on their way to the front line basically. And there's a lot, a lot, a lot that I love about this movie. I think all the actors gave great performances. I could really believe Kristen Dunst as this very experienced and kind of like the joys of life are all sucked out of her. But then Wagner's character is just like this very cocky, flirty guy who's kind of excited by the violence. I definitely buy that and find that very interesting. Kaylee character is this very inexperienced young woman who's just like a young version of Kristen Dunst's character. That's kind of the point of it. This movie doesn't have a lot of dialogue. It's more so trying to convey emotion through stunning visuals and it definitely works at times. Really anytime a gun goes off it's a really good scene. They're really intense. Like there's a scene where there's a shootout basically. That's super intense. That was like the first really great scene. The last like 10-15 minutes are just incredible. There's hardly any dialogue but like the thud of all of the guns going off and explosions happening just rocky to your core. There's a scene where things don't look so good for our heroes and that one's definitely very very intense and works really well. Not every single like harrowing image really strikes a chord. Good for instance is one of the characters is like take a look at this shit and then it's just a freeway covered in abandoned cars and stuff and I'm like yeah that was a really cool shot 12 years ago when I saw it in The Walking Dead but like now it doesn't really feel that haunting because I've seen it just so many times. I think what really doesn't work for me with this film and why I'm a little bit conflicted on how exactly I feel about it is that it very intentionally doesn't explain the situation of why is the United States in a civil war. They give very vague reasons and that's intentional because that's not the point. It doesn't matter what the reasoning is. The point is the horrors of war not the why of war. But because they didn't give us really anything substantial with the why, it feels like the movie's lacking, it feels like it's pulling its punches a bit. So yeah. I definitely enjoyed this movie a good solid amount. I think there's some really incredible images in here. There's a lot of good points and aspects to the movie. I think what the movie's going for mostly is good. I think it just needed a little bit more explanation to really drive home the points that the movie was going for. So would I recommend it? Yeah, definitely. It's definitely a well-made film with some really great visuals and some really solid performances. It just has a little bit of room for improvement, but even with that, it's still definitely without a doubt worth a watch. And now for my ranking, I put this at number seven in the quite like section. It was so close to a really liked, but I just couldn't quite push it over. And this is at a total of 22 new movies so far this year.